What's up, everybody, man? It's your boy, Doug Q, and we here for your weekly mock draft. Make no mistake about it. The Panthers have now on the clock. Look, if you haven't already, before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Show that love, man. You know, this is my favorite time of the year. It's mock time. Let's go. It. You already see it. You see what we're using. This is profootballnetwork.com. Uh, I like them a little bit better than some of the other uh, networks that do it, but let's get to it. Let's drive. All right. With that being said, you already see how it's falling to us. Let's take the time to really just pay attention to what's going on. We just got offered the number 12 pick by Houston and the 33 pick. Um, they want to kind of do like a pick swap. We got, uh, ooh, not bad, not bad. The uh, 21st and the 54th, and then the next year's first round. Not bad, man. Let me take a look and see what's going on over here. Who's off the board first? Will Anderson went as we project the Bears to go. Um, Miles Murphy, CJ Stroud, all of these guys are sitting here. Will Levis, Bryce Young went to the Lions. Wow. That's crazy. I did not expect to see that. But as you see it sitting over here, do you take what you need to take right here? If we trade back, bro, we're not going to get Anthony Richardson. Uh, I'm telling you right now, it's just luck that he dropped to us even right now. So I'm going to be that guy, and, I'm, and I promise you, I'm going to make sure that we get our quarterback right here, right now. Look no further. Let's select Anthony Richardson. You just solidified your franchise for the next years to come. That means going forward, you got everything you need now to, to really maneuver through the NFC. Um, we got trade offer. Hmm. I'm going to reject that. All right. Next pick. Let's see who's available, man, at receiver before I get started. Um, Keyshawn Boutte, wide receiver, LSU. I like that guy, man. Charbonnet, Devin, and Chain, all those guys are sitting right there. You don't draft a running back this high. Um, Kincaid is sitting right there. Mm. On defense, who's available? Siaka, linebacker, you got Noah Sewell, Jack Campbell. <clears throat> okay. <coughs> I'm going to be under the impression of, let's see who's the best available. Let's go ahead and get this guy on out here. Darnell Washington is not my guy. Mm. So it's between, for me, Keyshawn Butte which is a receiver for young young guy and Anthony Richardson, or you can look to get to get your guy a tight end. <clears throat> um, Kincaid is sitting right there. Will he be sitting right there with our next pick at 61? That's the question. But that's a gamble we're going to have to take. Um, Let's go ahead and, and let's make our selection, man. Uh, I'm going to go Keyshawn Boutte, wide receiver, LSU. I said if you all, I always said this, if you go and get your guy, make sure you get weapons for him. I rejected that offer. Now we're sitting here. Let's take a look at the overall defensive board to see who's there. That linebacker, uh, edge rusher, Derek Hall is sitting right there at D tackle. Mozzie Smith is also sitting right there. And I'm gonna tell you right now, as it stands, you just got a playmaker for your receive for, for your guy. And as this board stand, you're going to end up needing to get a tight end for your guy. I just want to know why is Darnell Washington falling 
so far from Georgia. Mm, I can't miss out on my guy at, at, at linebacker, man. I, I'm sorry. I, I can't. I'm to the point now where when is our next pick coming up? Our next pick coming up is not until 93. The linebacker that I want is not going to be sitting there at 93. So, therefore, you go ahead, you select your guy. The second round. That or you take an edge rusher. Because Derek Hall is sitting right there, too. Oh, man, you can't overlook Derek Hall. And we sitting right here at 61. That's an awesome pickup right there. I'm sorry, I had to do it. Let me see what we got here. So we got an edge rush just now. Jack Campbell is sitting right there. Oh my God. The heavens open all the way up. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, if that happened on draft night. Yes, sir. That is perfect. So, I mean, let's look at, put it in full perspective. We just got ourselves our quarterback of the future. We also got a receiver for him. We got a linebacker and an edge rusher. Woo! Starting off, we looking pretty good, man. We looking pretty good. I can't even lie. I can't even lie, brothers. If this happened on draft night, you better thank God that, you know, this was able to fall to you because uh, I'm going to go right here and I'm going to go ahead and get that tight end from Iowa. Let's, let's make no mistake about it. It's no time to play. Let's make sure that Anthony Richardson has everything he needs uh, moving forward. Let's make sure that we, we, we give this guy every chance and opportunity to win. That we could. Let's see. Offensive tackle. Offensive guard. Ooh. We got the potential to pick up a backup center right here. Now, make no mistake about it. We need a running back. And none other than Kenny McIntosh is sitting right there. Yeah. That's a no-brainer. We come back on in. If somebody's sitting there at offensive center, you take them. Michigan. That that that's a no-brainer as well. Let's get on into it, or we're gonna get into it. We're gonna turn this franchise around. Enough is enough, and we could go ahead on out here. And yeah, we're gonna get this thing together. Um, at this position, I could take a cornerback because we we're gonna need somebody that could potentially, you know, come in and be able to. Bruh, this draft is such a win. Oh my God, man. Anthony Richardson, we pull up. Keyshawn Boutte, Derek Hall, Jack Campbell, Sam Laporta, Kenny McIntosh, offensive center. We went and got, I don't know what his last name is. And then we got the cornerback, Bush from Cincinnati. I mean, this is a win right here, bruh. Let's talk about turning your franchise immediately around. Like Anthony Richardson will be ready to play possibly in the middle part of the season, towards the end of the season, but you got your QB of the future. What you do is you go and you get yourselves a bridge quarterback, somebody really cheap and inexpensive that can come in and, and give your quarterback time while he learns how to be an NFL professional. Keyshawn Boutte, you pair him with, uh, with your boy over there, and you got a, a, a one-two tandem. You got two number ones uh, with DJ Moore in the building. I mean, I like that. Then you look around, edge rushing, you need somebody to come off the edge and, and wreak havoc. Derek Hall is one of those guys. I already made a video about him already. I saw that happening with him. I thought he would be a big guy anyway. And that's a steal for us. Jack Campbell is the middle linebacker of the future. Quickest first step that you're going to see since Luke Keekley. And I'm telling you, him and you get his counterpart in the Sam Laporta, the tight end from Iowa. That's going to be another guy you can spread the field with, and he can really grow with the quarterback. But then if you want to add insult to injury, 
Kenny McIntosh, running back from Georgia. The power runner that you saw really running over guys is will be here in Carolina. And the other guys basically will be there for depth position, but they'll be able to play and really make the most of their first year. So that'll be good. I like this. This right here to me is a step in the right direction. This right here, you saw how it went. The draft board fell with us getting Anthony Richardson, and we had to take him. This is with no trades whatsoever. No trades whatsoever, man. So I like this. If this happened draft night, you can go ahead and start dancing because with Frank Wright and his staff, these guys, along with what we have on the roster, we'll be looking to take over the NFC South immediately. Look no further. Your boy Dub Q just laid it out for you. This is possibly the best draft scenario that could happen for a simulator. I love it, man. Let's make it happen. And this is all without trading any picks. Not trading up, not trading down. If you be patient, it'll come to you. So, yeah. This is your boy Dub Q. Like, subscribe.